Welcome to my new talk show, Svetlana Speaks. This show we will be talking about hot topics. And one topic I have been following very closely is sex. Sex in Hollywood. Sex in the media. Sex in politics. It's so exciting. And here to talk with me is my good friend Shirkin. Welcome, Shirkin! Yes, Shirkana. Yeah, I've been following you too. And it seems like every day someone else is involved in a sex scandal. I mean, who's going to be next? Pope Francis? Or I'll bet it's going to be Dr. Phil because he's always talking about loyalty and fidelity and having a great marriage with his wife who, by the way, buys some of her stuff. That, that would be a pretty good scandal. I think that would be fun. <laughs> well, personally, I don't see scandals when it comes to sex. Especially when it involves money. Well... If it's consensual, you know, there's really not a big problem with it. But a lot of these stories we've been hearing about, sex has been forced or coerced or someone's career is going to get ruined if they don't, you know, give someone a massage and a blowjob. But, um, you know, that, that's not right. I mean, you shouldn't have to do anything you don't want to. Hi. Always want to have sex with rich men because you get things. Fine if you want to, but you've got to understand, Shvetlana, not everybody is like you. I know. Everyone should be like me. Like you, Shirkin. You could learn a thing or two from me. Um, no. Uh, um. Oh, you know what? Another thing I don't think is fair. These women who try and get ahead because they, you know, are having sex with the boss, sucking the boss's dick, not really doing any work. Someone else is doing all the work, getting paid less, and this chick um, is living really well on the company perks. And, you know, that's not right. That's... That's corruption. What? This is fair. You suck both this dick, you get paid more. I don't see problem. This is fair. No. No. Prostitution is fair, but that is corruption. I mean, okay, okay, so it's all the company's money paying a prostitute. That is corruption. Okay, okay. Calm down, Shirkin. Let's get back to hot topic, which is sex and money and how when men and women get together, you cannot help but for sex to paint your picture. Not true. Oh, yes, is true. Shirkin, you just don't try hard enough to attract men sexually. I mean, look at you. What are you wearing? You look like a little brown mushroom with a little ribbon in here. Well, you know what? You may think I look like a little brown mushroom, but I don't care because I'm comfortable. And in my world, comfort is queen. I wouldn't want to look like you. I mean, aren't you cold? How do you even walk in those oh, things? Oh, what? What are you talking about? These? My shoes? They're shirking. When you wear shoes like this, you don't have to walk. The men, they carry you. And if they're too old to carry you, they just hire someone to carry you. But you gotta understand, I don't want that. And, like, a lot of women don't want that. We just don't want it. What? What's wrong with getting what you want? Nothing. There's nothing wrong with getting what you want. Um, 
All right, okay, you got me. If if you can find guys that want to carry you physically, financially, whatever, more power to you. You just keep doing that and, you know, I hope it works for you. This is spirit chicken. But you got to understand, I don't want that. And, like, a lot of women don't want that. We just don't want it. Bullshit! Women want you're just weird. Weird and flaky. Uh, okay, whatever, whatever, I'm weird. But you know what? Once I turned 50, I just, you know, I just stopped caring about trying to, like, impress men so much. It's more about me. It's more about how I feel about myself. How old are you? I'm 52. Hmm, you don't look that old, but you do look a lot older than me. I mean, but I'm only 35 years old. Um, weren't you 35 like eight years ago when I first met you? No, do your math. Okay, so when's your next birthday? When are you going to be 36? When are you going to be 40? When? Stop talking about this! Okay. You are just jealous because I am so young and beautiful. Okay, Shvetlana, if you say so. So, when I'm 80 and you're still 35, you just let me know how this relying on men for money and transportation is going for you, all right? Okay? Well, this is turning around into nasty talk. I wanted to talk about the wonderful subject of sex and money, but Sherkin just want to make fun of me. So I want to say to all these men who everybody is saying bye-bye to, bye-bye, such bad scandal. Harvey Weinstein, Lucy K, Mitt Lover. Oh, I don't care. Pope Francis, Dr. Phil, when this happens to you, you come to Shvetlana and I make it all better. So, I love you all. Please like and subscribe so I make a lot of money. Okay. Bye-bye.